Trevor James, aka the Food Ranger. Good man. Good to see you too, bro. I know, I know. We haven't spoken like this whole summer. You've been like chilling in the Italian Riviera, man. Yeah, Italy was good, man. Italy was good. How you been? I've been good, man. I've been good. I've been, you know, just working, getting things going. I'm excited. I'm going to my 92nd country, Iraq, really soon. But oh, yeah, dude, it's exciting. It's exciting. Amazing. Oh man, it's been it's been a while since we had our Dubai food adventure. I know, dude. It's almost been a year. Can you believe it? Oh really? N nine months. Nine months. Yeah, it was in oh, December. Wow. Flies. I know. Flies. We're gonna do it again, you and me, so somewhere in Africa. Let's do it. Let's, Let's do, do it. it. Yeah, that was that was amazing. The Dubai food tour. Do you remember? Do you remember all those places? Most of them, yeah. Most of them. We, we ate a lot of food. We ate a lot of food. <laughs> I don't know how we didn't pop that day because the first day in old Dubai, it was nonstop. I mean, we started with like some paratas, alu, meti, right? So much. I mean, masala dosa at Veg World. Masala dosa. Oh, and the butter. They loaded it with butter. Do you remember how much butter was on that? Too much butter, bro. Like a brick. And they loaded it on the dosa. It was so good. It's the Indian way, bro. Just load it up with ghee. <laughs> more butter, more better. More butter, more better. <laughs> One of the highlights for me that day was the, the king of biryani, dude. You took me to this place. Is it called Jafar? Jafar Bai. Jafar Bai. Jafar Bai. Oh, wow. He's amazing. And his butter chicken is insane oh, yeah. you remember that butter chicken i remember dude you, you know it's funny i was watching i was editing this video i was watching dude i was salivating i was like oh my god he said the best indian food outside of india is in dubai that's it really it is I, I think so it's incredible in dubai and that place is amazing yeah man it was so good i think uh what else did we have that day pani puri we had pav bhaji we had mughlai we had some mughlai biryani but with some saffron bread do you remember that yeah, yeah, via Lucknow. Oh, yeah, yeah, and the, the, the Tundi kebabs. The Tundi kebabs, too, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, man. Now we eat Tundi kebabs. Those were amazing as well. I think you also had it in Lucknow, right? You went to Lucknow. Yeah, also in Lucknow. What an amazing day. And we were, we were just so full, and I remember everyone was so friendly that day as well. Oh, man, they were amazing. They were, they were like, uh, the thing is that I feel like no one goes to that part of Dubai because that's like old Dubai, so different from like the skyscrapers. Yeah, and it was amazing to finally meet you after all these years because we were chatting for, for years on, yeah. online, right? I, I think we all were chatting other. since like 2015 or something, something crazy yeah, like that. always following each other, messaging, commenting, and then finally... We finally got to meet in Dubai and make some vids together, which was amazing. Yeah, bro. Thank you so much. It was awesome. And then the second day, we went to Sharjah, the Emirate, and we met up with our friend Rosena from the Minority Taste. Yes. And we did like a mix, yeah. like Arab breakfast. We did, uh, we had some uh, Malabar biryani, which was amazing, dude. I remember. Oh, yeah, yeah. That was like, uh, oh, that was so flavorful with all the juiciest meat. Remember they had a few different chicken, mutton. Uh, and then a village chicken too, I think. And, and a, I think they had a beef one too, like a beef style. Yeah, 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 exactly. We did a Juice World for some juices. We also did Pani yeah. Puri. Oh yeah, we did a Yemenite Mandy. Oh my God, remember that? Oh, the the le see. Remember the jiggle? The jiggle? <laughs> the the jiggle. jiggle lamb? It was so beautiful. Like, and it was so fair for the whole, the whole lamb on top of the rice with all the... Emirati, or it was Yemeni. Yeah, Yemenis, yeah, Yemeni. It was a Yemenite Mandy. That was, I think that was my first time trying Mandy and I was blown away, dude. I mean, the whole experience there and obviously with you and Rosena, amazing. But the, I think that what topped off that day was that last dish, the beef dosa. Oh, the beef dosa, yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, my God. You know, usually it's veg, but dude, the beef, I think it's a little better. It's a little better. And they brought us in the kitchen, and I remember all the spices they put into that that beef gravy. That it was just so packed. There was coconut. There was so many like like top quality spices. I think that's what was unique about it. It was so high quality, and we got to see how it was made. No, oh, dude, it was epic. It was epic. I, I really, really enjoyed every moment. And to be honest with you, what made the trip for me was you, bro, because you and me clicked like right away. It was like like my brother, bro, my Canadian brother. 
came back in Dubai, we can go explore. Maybe we can go to a, a nearby country and, uh, and eat some more somewhere around here. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let, let's figure it out. Maybe this winter at some point, we'll, I'll fly out there. But before, before we let everybody go, let's let them see what we did in Dubai and Sharjah. Here's 90 minutes, roughly, of our thing, right? Dang, you ready? I'm ready. Let's go. Okay, let's go. First spot is right up here by Bob for their famous Pao Baji. Pao Baji. So first spot we're going to today is, I don't even know how to say the name, but they have Pao Baji. If you guys don't know what Pao Baji is, that is like a vegetable curry with bread. Pao is bread in super Hindi. Super buttery, super buttery. Ultra butter level. This is amazing. It's like literally like little India here. Bye, Bob. Bye, Bob. For Pao Baji. Hello, my friend. You guys know where Vaibhav is for Papoji? Vaibhav? Vaibhav. This side. That side. Okay, okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank All right. So it's this way. Okay. It's this way. Yeah, so unfortunately, they're not making it right now, but we're going to get some paratas, right? Yeah. Incredible. Small lanes. This isn't like, uh, you know, in America where it's just like restaurant, restaurant, restaurant. This is like small hole in the walls. You get one thing and that's it. <laughs> this guy, you get stopped everywhere. <laughs> what is this? Salty curry. Crispy. Right. I need some chutneys for this though. So we're gonna start off here at Rokni, Rok N, and we're gonna do some paratas. So they have like eight different paratas. They have pani puri, they have a bunch of chats. What do we wanna try? I don't know, let's ask if we can get in and uh, see the making. Let's go into the kitchen and see how they make the paratas. Let's go. So if you guys don't know the biggest difference between this bread and like naan, on the grill, yeah. On the grill compared to being in the tandoor, right? Look at this, sizzling with the light. There's a key right there. So this is the panata king right here. So he's making like 10 paratas at a time. So what do we got? We have mint. We got mint, we got onion, and then it's all stuffed with the aloo masala, the potato masala. And he's yeah. just like rocking it on fire. Look at that. He's just There's like 10 parata going on here and they're all just getting placed here. Look at that. Oh, wow. And you smell that aroma. It's just amazing. It's just amazing. And so how it's made, very easy. So he flattens the, you know, the dough, then he stuffs it with the aloo. It looks like a stuffed dumpling, then he flattens yeah. it again. Yeah. It's awesome. And this is traditionally north. Yeah. North India. Yeah. Wow, this looks incredible, these paratas. Oh man, look at that. So that one is a mix, right? Then over there we have mint, we have aloo, and that's plain. Aloo's always in everything, right? So always potatoes. It's gonna be epic, all that desi ghee. Mm, nice and crispy. Crispy. Oh, it's gonna be epic. Plus the masala chai. The masala chai can't go wrong with that. We need that right now. Oh, that's the stuffing. Yeah. My friends, here we go. So Look at this that. is the alumeti, right? Alumeti. Yeah. Stuff so with the alu masala, right? Exactly. Stuff with alu masala, and then we have some coriander. We have mint or no coriander. There's cumin seeds. I think we have right here yeah, some cumin, green cumin. Jira, jira, right? And look, giant chili in there. Mmm. Wow. So it's gonna be super spicy and stuffed plump, like a big dumpling, but it's a flatbread. Mmm. Okay. Roma here is insane. So good. Yeah. That desi ghee. You know, that's, yeah, that's that's the ingredient, right? Okay, yeah. And then we also have over here some yellow doll. So it's gonna be paired with yellow doll, right? And then we also have what is it, mint or cilantro chutney? You know, it's crazy, but I feel like I'm in North India right now. That's how amazing this place is. Wow. So we just saw how they plated the alu meti. Yeah, alu meti. Yellow doll, right? So we yeah. also have some chili right here. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be it's gonna be spicy oh for sure. This is gonna be amazing. It smells fantastic. Yeah. It smells amazing. Yeah. <laughs> nice. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Shukriya, shukriya. This is it, right? So it's right here. Woo, look at this. Oh, it's giant. Beautiful. <laughs> look at that. It's like a North Indian pizza, right? Yeah. <laughs> Oh. Not pizza parata, I know. Yeah, yeah. So we have the yellow doll, we have the mint chutney, we have chai, we're waiting for two more chais, and right here we have some spicy pickle, right? Pickle chili. So this is called acha. Acha. So acha in Hindi is also good. So yeah. acha is good and acha is pickle. Pickles are good. <laughs> I'm gonna try it. Mmm. Is that good? <laughs> spicy as hell. <laughs> I gotta Ooh. go in for that. Wow. Let's break into it. Oh, look at that. Look at the masala on the inside. It's so rich. Oh wow, and right there you see the aloo, right? The aloo, the masala, the cumin mm -hmm. seed, the mint. And then should we dip it right into the doll? Ooh, luxury. Oh wow, it's a nice thick doll, huh? It's so thick. Hey, let's break this fast. Let's try it out. Mmm. -hmm. Oh. Oh wow. Wow. I love it, man. Nice mm. and crispy, right? Crispy. Full of masala, full of flavor. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, it's actually wow. spicy. The spice is building. It is. It is building, right? Mmm. And you can taste that mm -hmm. natural aroma from the 
the pan there. Exactly. Mm. The desi ghee mm. throughout. Mm. It's wow. Spicy. <laughs> it is spicy. I think next we have to try it with the chutney, right? The mint chutney. So much flavor. But this takes it up a notch, right? Mm. Cheers. Cheers. To that. Mm. Oh, it's refreshing. Mm -hmm. Cooling. Mm -hmm. Mm. Nice, cool it down. Yeah, mm. that is a delicious paratha. Super minty. The bread itself is nice and crispy and fluffy too. Mm. Mm. Wow, shukriya, shukriya. So good, so good. I would eat the whole thing, but we have a long tour today. We got a lot of food, yeah. You know, let me get a little more. Yeah. Yeah, so much flavor in this So one. much flavor. Mmm, mm -hmm. it's rich, mm -hmm. it's potent. It's spicy. Mm. Western palates can't handle this. Mm. Mm. You know what we're gonna do together? We both like spice. Extreme matcha. Extreme. <laughs> mm. Oh. Oh yeah. Mm. Oof. Oh, it's that's, deadly. That's intense. So is that? That's a pickled, like chili. Yeah. So oh, spicy. The acha. Spicy. I'm like, I'm oh. dying here. <laughs> we need a lassi. I need la You know what? We have some chai, right? Yeah. Yeah, we got lassi. You have lassi? You have a small lassi? You can cool it down with the chai. At least, you know, there yeah, is yeah. some milk in here, right? Oh, oh that's so oh. good. It's masala chai. Mm -hmm. There's no better chai than masala. Mm. It's not that spicy. Mm. Oh, you go for it, Ting. You're going to see. I mean, it's like super spicy. Yeah, it's spicy. Oh. Oh, thank you. Look at these mango lassi to cool down. If you guys don't know what lassi is, so it's basically like a yogurt drink. This one's mango, national fruit of India. Yeah. Oh. The am, what's it called? Amras, right? Am, amras, I think. I think. I'm still learning my <laughs> Hindi, bro. <laughs> Seriously, spicy. Like, way spicier than other chilies. Right. You know, one last bite. I didn't have enough food this morning. I am starving. Mmm. Oh my gosh. So good. Love the stuffing. Mmm, that was nice, right? Nice and light. Mmm, the mint chutney though. I would literally just drink it. Mmm, a little bit, a little sour. I love it. It's so crispy. Mm. Spicy acha. Like super spicy. Acha, chai, chai. Chai, chai. Masala, yeah, chai, chai. Yeah. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Wow, it just brings back the memories from India. Yeah, I would ha have like five or six of these a day. Yeah, you yeah. Know? And you just get like pumped for you eating. Get pumped. Exactly. Yeah. And don't call it tea because people get offended. Oh, by yeah, that, yeah. You know? So it's like chai, chai, chai. Yeah, chai, chai. Ah. Uh, cool it down. Especially don't call it chai tea. That's oh, like yeah. saying tea, tea. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you don't in the state, you will do that though. Yeah, yeah. Chai tea. It's chai like, tea. Nah. Right. Let's see how much food we can eat today. It's going to be good. But then next up, we're going to a place that have dosas, right? Yeah. Veg world? They got tons of dosas, South Indian dosa. Let's go check it out. This always happens. Too much hospitality. Are you sure? Please. <laughs> no money. I feel bad. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Shukriya. 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 This is what usually happens with Indian hospitality, yeah, man. They Indian do not. They don't let you pay. Yeah. Ever. <laughs> the people here are so nice. They're going to all come out. The entire selfie. stop. Do a big selfie. Come, come, come. Acha. Acha. Yeah. My stomach is burning a little <laughs> yeah, bit. Me too. It was really spicy. Oh, dude, that was one of the spiciest things I've had this year. Yeah. Like, I felt it, like, in my eyes, yeah. you know? And I just, my me head too. just started melting. Yeah, it's like the instant burning, like. <laughs> <laughs> and next up, we're going to Veg World. So this place has, like, 500 different dishes. Yes, 500 yeah. dishes on their menu. Yeah. And we're going for dosas, right? So yeah. Indian dosa, which is Indian crepe. Yeah, South Indian should be good. Should be awesome. And look at this neighborhood. Super cool. I know, right? So many amazing Indian restaurants. Feels kind of like you're in India. If it was going to be vegetarian, it would have to be Indian food because it's just so delicious. There's no better veg cuisine on the planet. Oh, I haven't found any other one yet. Yeah. <laughs> South Indian specials. Should be good. They have an outside counter rice so you can come here and get some quick stuff like balapav, pani puri. We're going to go inside for the dosas. Let's go check it out. Let's go. Dude, you almost took my friend's hand off, man. <laughs> What's what, the best dosa? What's your favorite dosa? Masala dosa? dosa? Yeah, masala dosa. This so one, Gini. Oh, Gini. Gini dosa. Gini dosa. What's the, what's the Gini dosa? Uh, cheese, tomato, onion, capsicum. With masala? Uh, okay. Oh, okay. Did you try that? No. So you want to do a Gini dosa and a masala dosa? What do you want? So it's the doctors. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't need a cap because I'm bald. Oh, man. What is that? It looks good. I'm a little butter. It's like the number one butter, right? Okay, yeah. okay. Look at that, you can see the curry leaves, there's tomatoes in there, uh -huh. lots of masala. Uh -huh. oh, this is what makes it. Right here. Oh, oh the sambar. sambar. This is my all-time favorite chutney. Looks good, yeah, oh, it's the best. Oh, it's the best. It's the best. 
Look at that, he's just wrapping the circumference there. He calls the Titanic, right? Yeah, yeah. It's like a monster sandwich. Wow, it's gonna be a super spicy. Is this for us? Yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Luxury, look at this. Wow, look at that, alu. Loaded with alu. Oh, he's just making it rain with cheese. And then just loading it up. Oh, and then more butter. So many great. Looks really good. Chef Kobe, uh, and he's gonna be making the genie dosa. Uh, genie dosa. Special yeah. genie dosa yeah, yeah. from South India. Yeah. Capsicum, tomato, and cabbage yeah. Yeah. into mm -hmm. a bowl. Yeah. I've actually had the genie dosa before yeah. in Bangalore. Yeah, yeah, I had yeah. In Bangalore. In case you guys don't know what the batter is made of, it's black gram and rice. So basically, lentil batter mixed with rice. And then, oh, he's adding tomato paste on top. The masala he added was basically papaji, right? Yeah, he added papaji sauce. The capsicum, the Szechuan sauce, yeah. the cabbage. Uh, spicy. Spicy. Oh, wow. hard. Hard. Amul cheese. Yeah. Look at that. It's a rare setting to see cheese on dosa. It's you amazing. You see it, right? This is just beautiful. Lots of butter, lots of cheese. It's all in there. So this is basically your dosa, pizza style dosa, right? Yeah. You had a coriander on top at the very end and that butter, so that's a very good butter, It's looking right? rich, amul butter. Yeah. Here's the sandwich. Look at that. Wow. Vegetable cheese grill. Vegetable cheese grill. Yeah. Yeah. We're making Titanic. <laughs> it's like a boat. It's like a boat. It is, look at that. Titanic sandwich. It's beautiful. Genie dosa. Yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. Let's go. Well said. So yeah. we just saw how they made the genie dosa, the masala dosa, and the Titanic the sandwich. The Titanic sandwich. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's awesome. It's awesome. Thanks, guys. Thank you. The street doesn't get any better, does it? Does Look not get any better than this. And here's the masala dosa. Thank you. Thank you. Look at that. What's funny is they came here for one thing and they gave us three. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Here we are, man. We got a lot of good food today. Look at these. Too much. This wow. is gonna be epic. That's extreme dosas. It smells so buttery. Mm-hmm. Wow, okay, what should we go for first? Uh, I think this guy, right? Okay, mm -hmm. look at that, like cheesy, full of that pao bhaji sauce. Then we got the masala dosa. The inside here is just loaded with potato masala. Mm -hmm. And then we got the Titanic sandwich. Should be good. Oh, it's hot. Oh, it's wow. super hot, piping hot. Oh man, look at that. Oh, so hot. So plump with that pao bhaji filling. Yeah, so we're gonna try it just like this without the chutneys after we do that. Okay, let's try. Let's try. Mm. Oh. Mm. Whoa. Oh wow. Pao bhaji. Mmm. Spicy, but so good. The cheese, right? Oh my goodness. That is unreal. Mm -hmm. Look at that. There is a lot of butter in there. Mm -hmm. So much flavor in that butter. The dosa itself is actually just like saturated with the flavors and that Szechuan sauce that he put in there. Mm. Mm. It's like a mix of like doughy and crispy and you have that like it, it's Szechuan, right? It's Szechuan. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. Mm. Mm. So flavorful. Oh. That's the best chutney. Mm. Mm. You gotta try that. Next up, we definitely have to dip this into coconut chutney. This coconut? Coconut chutney. Mm -hmm. Man, that's good. Oh, so hot still. So flavorful. Mm. Mm. You can't stop eating. Can't stop. Can't stop. Can't stop. Not too spicy. Seriously, one of the best dosas I think we've ever had. Mm -hmm. So flavorful. I think so. Enjoyable. Cheesy. Mm -hmm. Full of pao bhaji and Sichuan spice. It's like everything in one, yeah. right? Indian Sichuan. Szechuan, they call it. Yeah. <laughs> Szechuan. Szechuan. Yeah. It's like basically Indo Chinese, right? Yeah, Very exactly. Similar. Oh, this is like falling apart. Oh, man. So deliciously messy. <laughs> mm. It's so delicious. Oh. Next up, we should try the Titanic here, right? Let's do it. Look at that. It's like totally the Titanic. <laughs> We got tomato, cucumber, capsicum, cabbage, cheese. Mmm. 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 It's refreshing. Mm -hmm. With the mint chutney. Mmm. I like that it was pressed. Mmm. 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 Big mm. mix of vegetables in mm. here, huh? And cheesy. It's delicious. Mmm. What says like these sandwiches apart is the veg versions, right? So there's no, there's no meat in here. This nothing. is all veg. It's all veg. Pure veg. Yeah, I love that it's like literally a salad in a sandwich, yeah. right? Yeah. And it's flavorful. Let's break into this. Yeah, break into it. Oh, ho, ho, look at that. Masala dosa. All right, so oh, just man. jump in here, right? I'm getting full on dosa. Oh, uh, me too. 
So we're just dipping in the coconut chutney. Oh, always, right? It's the best chutney ever. Best chutney in the world. This one and uh, the ginger for me. Oh yeah, oh ginger, oh, oh yeah. So good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. I love it so much, I drink it. Oh man. Nothing like it, right? Coconut chutney. Yeah. Nothing like it. South India. You guys didn't know there was street food in Dubai. There is. You just gotta sit on the street. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is the best, right? So you just gotta grab this mm. beautiful dosa. Go in and grab that nice masala. Let me try the sambar. We haven't tried the sambar yet. So it's like a vegetable stew, basically, right? Mm. Mm -hmm. Lentils and veg and... Mm. How's that? Mm -hmm. It's good. Super healthy. So good. Oh wow, and what's this? Dokla. Ah, dokla. Gujarati. Dokla. Gujarati. Ah, Surat. Ah. From Surat. Oh, okay. I actually tried this in a Medabad. This is dokla, right? So Cuban on top? Spicy. Not, not spicy. Not spicy, but there's chilies on the side. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny they say it's not spicy, but there is. Oh, you're gonna bring more? Don't, don't bring more, dude. <laughs> this is dokla. Basically made from chickpea uh, batter and yeah, also and lentils. Some, some dolls, some lentils. I think it was urad as well, right? Yeah, urad. Exactly. And then they kind of, I think they grind it all up and make it into a batter. Exactly. And then they steam it. Try it out, bro. Mmm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mmm. Very nice. Very nice and fluffy. It's fluffy, sweet, mm -hmm. mustardy. Mmm. Mm. Spicy. And spicy. If you want, you can. Wow. Those are sweet. Chilies are sweet. It's not spicy. Go oh, be careful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it's basically a very sweet and spicy lentil cake, right? Oh. Mm hmm. Mm. I like the sweetness though. Mm. The mustard seeds. Very nice. My friend, thank you so Amazing. much. Delicious. Shukriya. Delicious. Shukriya. Shukriya. Now you know, Veg World right here in Mina Bazaar. Mina Bazaar is the area, but there's actually an area within Mina Bazaar that is like a real bazaar. Wow, 500 dishes here. If you really want to, you can go all out and try them all. I tried five, and I'm full. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I'm happy to know that you enjoy them. <laughs> Please, please, please. No, no, no. This is the running theme. <laughs> shukriya, shukriya. shukriya thank thank you. you so much. Shukriya. We appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. On the streets. We're back here. Of Dubai. Let's of Dubai or Mumbai? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Oh man. Let's go. Let's, Let's go. go. So this is all Al Karama area here. We're just driving through. There's tons of Indian restaurants, and up here should be the one we're going to right now. And here we are in Al Karim. This place actually reminds me a lot of like Kuwait. The style of the buildings, right? Super desert feel. I'm always watching your all videos. Oh, thank you in so the much. Pakistan, in... so there are hundreds of restaurants in this area. Lots of Indian food. Where are we going? We're going for a more. Just right out here, there's a really good spot. Yeah. Let's go check it out. Let's go. Let's... <laughs> yeah, Jaffer Bai, Jaffer Bai. Some of the best biryani in Dubai is just down there. Seriously good Indian food, like one of the top spots. It's gonna be amazing. Check it out. Let's go check it out. <laughs> <laughs> and this is it, Jaffer Bai, the Biryani King of Mumbai. Biryani King of Mumbai? Let's go eat with our hands. All right, guys, we are going in the kitchen to see the biryani and maybe some other dishes being made. Oh, man, how you doing? Good. Yeah. All right, let's go in here. Oh wow! So the first dish we're seeing made being made is lamb brains, lamb brain fry. That sounds awesome. That sounds freaking delicious. All Mumbai food. Yeah. Really spicy, huh? Oh, yeah. So what else should we try? The brain fry, and then brain fry, and then butter chicken full, and, and then we cook the... Uh, biryani? Uh, biryani, mutton biryani, shahi mutton steak. Oh, mutton steak, okay. This dish, it's like an upgraded scrambled egg. Exactly. Seriously. Extreme aroma. Okay. Yeah. Thank That's you. the mutton brain fry. A jabber bites. Amazing. Bice. Awesome. Delicious. Super delicious. Mm. Like you said, it's like an upgraded scrambled egg. Yeah. Mm. All the masala. Mm -hmm. If you didn't tell me that was brains, I would never know. Yeah, it's really good. It's so good. So well, if you guys don't know what this is, it's basically a scramble of brains mixed with vegetables, but it's almost like a dry roast, right? Yeah, yeah, so delicious. Like the butter just makes it extremely aromatic. All the cumin seeds, the masala. It's really nice. Butter chicken gravy. Wow. 
sometimes they use the thigh, you know, dark meat, sometimes breast. This one, breast and leg. Yes, yes. Okay, awesome, awesome. So this is, in Hindi, this is mug, murk makni. So it's chicken makni, right? Yes, yes. Murk. Yeah, as it simmers, it gets thicker, right? Yeah, yeah, it's getting thicker and thicker. Thicker and thicker. Oh, nice and red. It actually reminds me of like chicken tikka masala, just the, the color. Yeah. Because in America, it's more like orange. Yeah. Yeah. That's going to be amazing. With oh. some naan, with some garlic butter naan. Oh, yeah, for sure. All right, so next up we're gonna see the biryani. We're basically just gonna plate it because it's already finished, right? That's a slow cooking process, and it's usually in these massive vats over here. Oh, that's the secret. Look at how, look at how much masala's on there. And then here comes the lighter, right, to go over top. So it's a lot of masala on the bottom. Amazing. So that's a mutton biryani. So if you guys don't know mutton, that's goat in India. Mutton, so good. And on the bottom of this one, they actually is aloo, right? So it has yeah. potatoes, so potato masala. So aloo, aloo, right? Have some aloo? Aloo. Right? In the masala, right? Yeah, masala. Yeah. So here we have the mutton sea kebab. So these are real kebabs. Anything else is not really a kebab. So the seek, right? So that's the Seek minced kebab. meat, right? Yeah. And so this is uh, some mutton, so this is goat, right? Yeah, mutton with onion, with garlic ginger, with the fat, mm -hmm. and it's all ground up and made into a kebab. And it's going to go into the tandoor, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, garlic naan. Thank you. Thank you. Should be good. Hey, so have you ever seen the tandoor with coal? First time for me, actually. I've never seen a clay oven like this. It's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. It's beautiful, and it's going to give it more aroma. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Oh, look at that! Oh, look at this And lemon. We're ready to eat, we're hungry. Thank you, shukriya, shukriya. Boom, boom, boom. No, seriously, I'm starving. We waited like two hours to eat. We're hungry right now. It's gonna be awesome. The biryani, man, the biryani. Thank you. Mutton si kebab. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, I just need one, my man. <laughs> just one. <laughs> man, that smells so good, so buttery. This is just amazing. Here we are, look at this. That's the garlic butter naan. Man, that looks good. And Not you can beautiful. just soak it with your <laughs> butter chicken. Should that be the first bite? Yeah, for sure. Okay. So we just put it here, just rip off a piece, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. One hand, yeah, local uh, way. Uh, I try to do the local yeah, way, yeah. right? Oh, it's so, it's so buttery. Oh. Here we go. Mmm. Oh my god. Whoa. It's, um, it's a lot pastier than your usual butter chicken, right? It's so, so delicious. Mm -hmm. It's stronger. Mm hmm. It's stronger. A little spicier, a little thicker. The masala and but smooth at the same time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Dude, I'll Yo, say I think I've ever best for chicken ever. Really? Like ever? Yeah. I mean, in America we don't get it like this. Mm. Definitely not. And then that naan. Mm-hmm. Garlicky, buttery. Yeah, nothing like the smoky naan mm. coming from the tandoor. Oh, this is unreal. unreal. Gotta try this butter chicken. Should we jump on the, the brain fry right next yeah, door? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right next door. <laughs> right next door. <laughs> down, bro. Let's take it down. Let's go. Mmm. 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 Wow. It's so just smooth. Smooth and buttery. Lots of butter here. Mmm. Mmm. Love the vegetables, right? Yeah. So you have tomato in there, right? Mmm. It's their premium masala. Mm hmm. You can taste the quality. Exactly. Yeah, I mean, it, it really gives you the sense of scrambled eggs, but extremely exotic. You know, obviously, yeah. we're talking about lamb brains, very yeah. different. I actually haven't had this in India. You're never? No, not this one. I had mm. something similar in similar. Pakistan, like takata, okay, right? Yeah. With like every organ possible. But this mm. is just something mm. special. Wow, this restaurant is awesome. It's good, right? The next one we should try is the sikh kebab, right? Mm hmm. Right out of the tandoor. Beautiful. The cold tandoor. Yeah, the cold tandoor. The cold tandoor. A little onion, a little turmeric. I think you said garlic. Yeah. Right? Let's take it down. Mm. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. A little mint in there. Yeah, a little mint. A lot mm. of fragrance here, mm. right? Mmm. It's like a minty kebab. Mm. Wow. Oh. Oh. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you so much. Shukriya, shukriya. Shukriya. Cheers. Boys just drink straight. <laughs> <laughs> Not so thick. Mmm. Mm. Mm. So refreshing though. Wow, that's amazing. Mm. I love this drink. Man. Man, this is a good meal. This is like some of the best Indian food <laughs> I've had in my life right here. Really? Mm -hmm. Just everything's so fresh. Me too, it's just top top quality. Mm -hmm. And it's so unique. In that's what you get here. Right? Top quality Indian food, premium masalas. It's addictive, you can't stop eating. Mm. You can't go wrong if you come here. I don't think I could leave anything. No. <laughs> Not really today. Yeah. Mm. Mm. 
That butter chicken number one. It's seriously good, right? That's like, never had taste like that. Heard that Dubai had some of the best Indian food on the planet. It seriously does. No. It seriously does. Kebab? The kebab. <laughs> the kebab. Oh man. This is like the ultimate kebab with the mint. Yeah, it's minty, right? Mm -hmm. The garlic, the mint, and that natural whole tandoor. Exactly. And he was saying they bring fresh lamb and fresh goat from India, plus the and, spices. And the premium masala, the premium masala, the homemade premium masala brought in from India. Wow. Exactly. Awesome. Mmm. Mm. Mm. That's amazing. That's an amazing kebab. Mm. This is malai. Yes. Okay. This is a good one. So it's marinated with malai. Malai, right? Wow. For me, the best meat is always on the bone. The bone, yeah. yeah. And this is in the malai, right? Yes. They use the malai mm. and they put it in the tandoor. Should we try it out? Yeah, Look at let's that. try it. Oh, <laughs> luxury. Oh. Wow. Mm. Oh. So tender, like straight butter. Yeah, you just your teeth just sink into it. Mm-hmm. Mm. It goes down so easy. Do I have to say the best of the best of the best? Oh, it is the best, <laughs> right? right? You just open it up like that. Oh yeah. Yeah, take it off. Yeah, just open it up. That meat is just premium. Mm-hmm. Natural smokiness from the tandoor. Dubai has some of the best Indian food in the world. Yeah. I'd say so. You agree? Yeah. Yeah. I mean everything has been so tasty. <laughs> It's, you know, it's so different because the freshness of everything you're getting and it's coming almost directly from India. I mean, it's right there, right? Mm. Wow. It's amazing. And you said 40% of the population here are Indians, right? I think, yeah. From my understanding. Oh man, it's addictive. I know. <laughs> you can't stop. <laughs> mm. oh, look at that. Oh, wow. So that's the mutton? Yes, it's mutton. And then there's the aloo in there too, right? Sorry, yes. Bone, that's where the flavor is. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just take a little aloo. Yeah, yeah. David is the Indian food expert, the biryani expert. You've traveled all over India, so what's the best way to eat this biryani? Okay, so obviously we're gonna use hands for this. We don't use a spoon. The reason for that is because the metallic flavor definitely changes everything, right? Yeah. So that's a major reason. Um, in you know Kerala, Malabar, they use right up. They usually put it on top. I would suggest putting it on the side first. Okay, look at that. Yeah, put it on the side first. Yeah. Ready? It can go with hands. Yeah, definitely mix okay, in here, take right? Take some aloo and meat, right? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Ooh. Oh, and it's still really hot. It's so hot. You got the potato, you got that masala. Dude, it's all about the masala. The more masala, the better. Yeah, and literally just fell off the bone, right? Oh, and you have bone marrow on here. Oh, prime so, flavor. Prime? <laughs> Alrighty. Alright. Let's try it out, man. Let's do it. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. With the potato? Mmm. Mm. The potato soaks all the flavor. Oh, wow. Nice and mushy, right? Like super soft. And the masala? Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. Wow. It's really nice. My favorite part right here. Mmm. 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 The bone marrow. Bone marrow. Mmm. Amazing mm. flavor. Mm. Oh man. Mmm. It's a good biryani. It's an amazing biryani, right? So what we should do, use the five elements, you know. Mix the raita. Mix it all. Yeah, now it's got in there. Mix it. And what the raita does, it makes, basically what it does, it makes it like a glue, right? Mm. Sticks it all together. Oh man. Like that, you turn into a ball. Oh yeah, look at that. Like a nice ball, right? So again, you know, people are hungry in the world, so you gotta like keep all the rice in. Mm. And then mm. go like that. We don't leave any rice. Oh man. It's good. With the raita. <laughs> this is amazing. I'm sure. This is amazing. Mm. The mutton, super fresh. Super tender. Super tender. Fall off the bone, look at that. Just keeps falling. And the masala, not too spicy. Not too spicy. But just really full of flavor. Yeah, exactly. So if you guys don't know what masala is, just break down, that is just spices. Yeah. Right? So whenever you have any gravies, that is masala yes. with cream yeah. mixed in, right? And this is their custom masala, homemade. Yeah. So that's where that flavor is coming from. Wow. Super delicious. Mm. Mm. This is the best biryani in Dubai, right? It definitely is. Mm. 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 <laughs> so much flavor. This is unreal. So much flavor in there. Mm -hmm. You know, some people think that this is like a fried rice, and it definitely isn't. No, 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 no. 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 This is this is a different thing. Obviously, because sometimes they do it on the pan. And that's more of a fried rice style, mm. right? Yeah. Trevor, thank you for bringing me to have the best biryani in Dubai. Mm. Oh my God. I'm glad we can do this, man. Mm. You add that right there, man. Oh yeah. You want some? Yes, please. Yeah, some gravy too on the side. Oh man, I'm so happy we can do this. After all these years, 
we finally can meet and eat together. Exactly. Mm. I know. This is the best way to get to know a person, right? Through eating. Through eating. Always. Yeah. I always, you know, it's funny because now when I like work with people, I literally meet them and two minutes later we're, we're filming. You know, so it's like, yeah. okay. <laughs> this is cool. Yeah. Oh yeah, the, mm. the, the gravy takes it up a notch, right? Oh. It's amazing. It's amazing. Mm. I'm so happy. This is like the third spot. No paying. My friends, no, no, we pay something. We pay something. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. Man, that was amazing. That was so good. And we're going for more. Let's go. India food all day. All day Let's long. Go. 24 hours straight. I think we're going to a place called Mumbai Express near here. Not for sure if it's open or not. Let's go check it out. Yeah, they say it's some really good pani puri. Let's go. Let's go. And here we go, Mumbai Express. Let's see some live pani puri. We're gonna see how they plate the pani puri. So we just saw the whole process of how they put it all together. Yeah. So we have tamarind pani, so it's like a sweet water, right? Yeah. We have mint cilantro pani, so that's more like masala water. Yeah. Then we have uh, aloo, we have chickpeas, we have and some other stuff. And the puris. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, let's take it down. Oh. Mmm. 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 Oh, man. It's just bringing back straight memories. Mm -hmm. My first pani puri ever in Mumbai. Like oh, a water too. explosion, mm -hmm. cooling, a little spicy. Mm. Mm. Perfect on a hot day. Yeah, and this one has a little bit of sweetness, a tamarind. Sweet, sour, spicy, crunchy. Crunchy, it's all in there. Everything. Amazing. Well, you can just drink that. Go ahead. <laughs> mm. I'll drink this one. You know what? There's an extra one in here. I'll take it down. Mm. Oh, let me see. You can taste all the spices in there. A little cumin in there for sure. Mm hmm. Mm. Oh, it's perfect. Oh, that's good. Amazing. Two pani puris wasn't enough, right? Yeah. <laughs> We're going to do gonna another see. live pani puri right yeah. here. So in India, where you see a guy like standing on the street with like a million uh, puris, then he just cracks it, fills it, and until you tell him to stop, he just keeps going. It's like a non-stop. It keeps going. Puri. We're going to do that right now. Mumbai Express. All the way from Mumbai. The Amazing. best. Amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Mm. 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 Still he will make it more wow. if you want. Mm. Still he will make it more if you want. Bring it that on. That was amazing. Mm -hmm. So good, nice and crunchy. Spicy, mm -hmm. sour, sweet. Oh, everything. Mm. Mm. It's addictive and cooling. Yeah. On a hot day in Mumbai. Yeah. Oh, that'll perfect. just cool you right down. Yeah, this especially will last it. Especially in the winter, it is good very well. Mm. Exactly. <laughs> I love this. Room temperature cold. Chilled one. Mm. So big, so full. Wow, what a combination of flavor. Mm -hmm. Sour, spicy, sweet, sweet, crunchy, mm -hmm. textures in there. So the main taste what you get in from the mint water. Okay. And you only get here. Only because here. we give you the proper taste as Mumbai taste. Yeah. It's amazing. It's funny though because you r really find this in north. Maharashtra and going north. In south, I never see this. Yeah. Balgapa, Pani Puri, Puchka, Puchka. Yeah, exactly. Different names. Amazing. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. This is awesome. Thank you, Raj. Oh, Thank I you. have another one. Oh, so good. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And it goes boom. And it just coats your entire taste buds. Like, Mmm. Look how like packed this one is to the rim. It's <laughs> good, right? I'm done. We just had like 20 of those. <laughs> Seriously, a lot. Baby, nice pleasure meeting you. Thank you. Uh, James also with you. Thank you so much. And uh, hopefully uh, I'll see you back. Oh, thank you, thank, thank you, you, thank you. Thank you. We are. Ting, I'm full. full. I'm yeah, too full. so you're too full. <laughs> I'm too full. <laughs> But you have 10. Oh, I had 10? <laughs> Third day eating, I had 10? That's crazy. That's cool. Okay, we've been to a bunch of places today. We're gonna take a mini break. We're gonna go see if we possibly eat some papaji, maybe something else. We'll see. So we came back to the, the first area where the Mina Bazaar is, because we want to see if they have some papaji. Hopefully we get some good luck. Let's see, right? Let's see. Let's see. Hopefully 
They're making pao bhaji. Oh, look at the butter! Wow. That's a big block of butter, isn't it? That's why it's so good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so pao in Hindi means bread. The bun. Bun. Yeah. It straight up feels like the streets of Mumbai. It really right? does. And the smells, the aromas, mm -hmm. amazing from the street tower. Oh, I love this. It's amazing. It's a huge tower, right? Yeah. And here comes, oh, the tomato. Oh, yeah. That's look at the that. Mumbai special. I came all the way from America yesterday for this one dish. <laughs> they get tons of butter now. No way. Oh, that's that. the flavor. That's the flavor. Should be good. Should be really good. So I had this first time in Mumbai. I also had it in Medabad. This is amazing. So it's basically like a vegetable curry, right? Yeah, and now we can have it in Dubai. In Dubai. Right here. Tomato, lots of butter, capsicum. Look at that. Oh man. And it's just lots of masala, a little bit of chutney in there, mm -hmm. chili. So nice and pasty, pasty and, and then he's getting the bun now. Yeah, and it's gonna be soaked into a bun. Okay, so he just threw in a huge chunk of butter. Yeah. Next up, we got the buns. Then he soaks up all the vegetable curry inside, right? Yeah. Butter. Look at that. <laughs> That's crazy. It's like we're both having a huge block of butter with oh, this dish. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, chef. Looks good. All right. Here we are, man. This is Look it. at these beauties. Ultra extreme butter levels. Look at those. Oh my goodness. Look at that. It just looks amazing. He, he loaded a lot of butter in there, and then at the end, he loaded even more butter in. Too much butter. Too but much butter. I think that's what makes us this, right? <laughs> yeah. The butter. Extreme butter level. Extreme. <laughs> so, how do we do it? We just open okay. this up. Oh, oh yes. So, we're loading it up, right? Let's just load it up. Like just get one piece. Completely loaded. Oh, look at that. <laughs> yeah. Man, you can smell wow. the butter. Like Slider here. Ready right to go. Down. Let's take it sure. down. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Oh. Oh man, that's extreme butter. Mmm. Mmm. Butter everywhere. Mmm. Mm. Soft bun. Yeah. In the bun. In the curry. Mmm. Mmm. Real light tomato aroma. Yeah. And I like the spice level, not too much. Not right? too much. Mmm. It's just so soft. Yeah. I love this bun. Mmm. 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 Pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. I like it. It hits Enjoy the spot. It. Yeah, it's good. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you've never been to Mumbai, and you're in Dubai, come eat this. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, 4,000 calories in this whole bite. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I'll have another bite. Yeah. For good measure, right? Yeah. <laughs> mm. Maybe I'll have one more too. It's pretty nice. Mm -hmm. And you have no cream in here though. No, no. cream, just butter. It's just like a tomato, potato, butter, masala. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I like the masala in there. Yeah. Isn't it not too spicy? Yeah. Just right. Yeah. Last bite, guys. It's so good. Mm hmm. Buttery bun, vegetable curry. Wow. What a day. What a day. Look at all that dough. Wow. Huge amount of dough. Like, easily like 10 pounds of dough right here. Yeah, just yeah. rolls it all out and makes these beautiful, fluffy pals. Yeah. Little buns. Yeah. Oh, it's so good, right? Yeah. Because it's made right here. Yeah. Ukriya, thank you. Thank you. Hey, shukriya, shukriya. Thank you, thank you. I'll yeah. see you guys soon. Yeah. Yeah. One day, one day, I promise. Yeah, sure. Come, you come. We're on a full-on yeah. ranger tour. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> okay, guys, so we've been on a hunt for sweets. You know, we cannot do an Indian street food tour without some Indian sweets. They we're gonna go for a lassi shop, right? Yeah, lassi. I think it's just right around the corner. Okay. We so just heard word that it's a really good one just right around here, so... Let's go try it out. Lassi, Faluda, maybe some Gulab Jamun. Maybe, oh yeah, that'll be good. Who knows, right? I love that. Next up, Muhammad is bringing us for some local saffron tea. He's just guiding us here. Some oh, saffron right here. chai right here. Saffron chai. So the Lassi spot's over here, yeah. and we're gonna get some chai over here. Saffron right chai. Here. Food ranger. Food ranger right, right here. Big fan of you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Just try Kullati, my specialty. No, this is with the dry fruit. So oh. we're gonna get some uh, matka chai, right? So that comes in a clay cup, right? Clay cup? With saffron. So basically, you drink it, throw the cup to the floor. Biodegradable. In India, here you don't do that. <laughs> Not in Dubai. We're going, going in to see the chai. Small shop, tiny shop. Pista badam. Pista badam. So he's put pistachio and almond in the bottom of these clay cups. Saffron. Luxury. Saffron is the most expensive spice on the planet. Yeah. Ooh. Luxury. Saffron chai with uh, the mud cup, right? Yeah. Okay. Clay pot with the pista badam. Mm, Thank you. The smell, man. 
Very different. Whoa! Right? Only three, three though. Only three though. Fifty cents? That's like uh, seventy cents. Seventy cents. Six, seventy cents. Okay. That's amazing. It's a good deal. That's seriously some of the best chai. Milk in there. We got some tea. And then what else? We have cardamom for sure. Cardamom, yeah. Ginger. The cardamom. Ginger. No, no, no ginger. No. Okay. Mmm. And the nuttiness. Mm -hmm. You get chunks. You get chunks of you almond, get right? Chunks of almond. Chunks of pistachio. Mm -hmm. This is so good, especially right now. You need to like. Cool down from the long energy. day. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's been a good day. We've been eating a lot today. Mm. That ultra floral aroma. Exactly. Mm. The bottom, so chunky. <laughs> you want some more? I'm good, man. Thank you. Yours? Yes. Buy a luck now? Yes. This is yours. Wow. Yes. Amazing. City of Nawabs. Yes. Yes. Tunde <laughs> Kababi. Yes, always. Uh, Tunde Kabab, then Shirmal, everything. Kabab Paratha, Awadhi Biryani. You know, Idris Biryani, when you go over there, so all the special delicacies of Lucknowi food, we bring it together in the in the Dubai. Right here. So now we're going up to the kitchen to see how they make the tundi kebabi. Guys, how you doing? Hello, hello. It's a tundi kebab. Oh wow. Today there is a beef also, but in Dubai we are making only with the butter. Pure mutton, pure butter. Yeah, so the beef that you get in Lucknow is buffalo. It's yeah. not cow. No, no. That's the Mughlai paratha, right? Yes. Mughlai paratha. So, they, so what do they do? They turned over the wok and then they put it on top, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. With the oil on both sides. Yes. With oil, huh? So it's a little different. So we're putting oil onto the shirma. Yes. Yes. The saffron oil. Wow. The, the bread we are making with the milk, not with the water. Oh. Yes. We are not. So it's like dough and milk mixed yes. together. Yes. Wow. There it is. Thank you, Chef. Thank you. Tundi kebab, and then we've got the saffron shirma, right? Yes. This is like a naan, but with saffron, right? Yeah, and it's made with milk, so it's shirma, right? Alright, let's go downstairs and try this tundi kebabi. Yeah. If you guys didn't know, in luck now, the place is called tundi kebabi. Oh! <laughs> saffron shirma and the tundi kebab. What should we try? The mughlai paratha first? Buttery, look how soft it is. It's just melting. Oh my gosh, it's like kebab. literally falling apart. In that bread. No chutney. Just straight in the kebab. Okay. All right. Let's try it out. Mmm. 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 Mm. Oh, it's soft. Oh my gosh. Wow. It just falls apart like butter. Mmm. It melts in your mouth. Literally melts in your mouth. Mmm. Wow. A little smoky, as you were saying, right? Mm hmm. A little spicy, maybe? Little. If you want, it's vegan customized. It's very nice. Nice spice here. That's nice. Mmm. Mmm. I love this. It's Mughlai Parata. And that bread is, yeah, flaky. Yeah, you know what it reminds me of? Like the Armenian lavash. Mmm. Lavash. Lavash. Very similar. Mmm. I want to remove this. Oh, you want us to try this one? Okay. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Right there, right there. Look yeah. at that. Beautiful. Golden saffron. Mmm. -hmm. He's slapping it with the saffron water. Yeah. It's amazing. Oh. It's still super hot. <laughs> oh, it's so hot. Okay, and then with the tundi kebab, right? Okay. Yeah, so it has a lot of layers, almost like a parota. Yeah. So it's mutton, minced mutton patty, basically. Yeah, right? it's like a patty. Yeah. Super soft, and it's fried there on the grill. Oh my gosh, it smells amazing. Let's try that. Cheers. Saffron shirma. Mmm. 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 Oh. Where has it been all my life, man? Oh, so that. Good. That bread. You can taste it's more milky. Yeah, definitely. Mmm. A little thicker, fluffier, right? Yeah. Mm. Wow. Maybe a little bit of saffron aroma too. Exactly. Right? It's amazing mm. how they just like slap mm. that water sweet. on. It's sweet. A little sweet. A little sweet. Mmm. Mm. Oh. Mmm. It's mm. like a sweet, milky bread. Exactly. Mmm. So it'll be per perfect pairing with chai, right? It's so fluffy. Mm. It's almost gooey. Mm -hmm. It's so soft. Look at that. Yeah, if you didn't know any better, you would think this is like a pan de queso. Yeah. Right? Look at that. The inside is like jelly almost. It's mm -hmm. so soft. What a day. What, what a, a day. day. Lots what of day. good food. Mmm. 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 What's this? And then what's this? Thought we were done and now we got two more. Well, a kebab and a dessert. So, boti kebab. What do you put inside the boti kebab? Small, small pieces of mutton. Mutton? Like a boneless mutton. Masala? Masala, that's it. So, it's like a mutton gravy. Yes. Boti kebab. Thick gravy. Thick gravy. Okay. Okay, and eat with the shirma. Yes. Yeah. Let's get a little oh, bit here. Oh, man. No bones. Mmm. 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 Mm. Mm. Oh, it's pure gravy. Thick mm -hmm. gravy. Thick gravy. Thick gravy with ginger. Mm. I think I like this one more than the tunde. Mm. 
Mm -hmm. Different. They're both amazing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. It's like a gravy, that one's more potty. Yeah. Mm. Mm. That's rich. Mm -hmm. Super rich. No, it's not alba. No, so it's, it's like alba. dokla. No, 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 it's a sweet. Oh, this is bread. Yes, it's wheat, wheat flour. Yes, wheat flour. Wheat flour, oh, okay. Okay, so wheat flour dessert with pista badam on That's top. That's right, wheat flour with pista badam. Okay. And then is this rubbery? That's rubbery. Rubbery. Oh, so. That's so luxury, <laughs> man. These desserts, <laughs> Indian luxury. desserts are so delicious. And some nuts on top? Yeah. Mmm. 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 Saffron? Mm -hmm. Nice. It's a crumbly bread. Crumbly. Mmm. Mm -hmm. So delicious. So sweet. And sweet. Nice and decadent, right? Decadent. And the raspberries, sometimes you have it with the jalebi, right? No, no, it's not. I didn't do that no, I know, but I had it in Delhi. Mixed. You have it mixed. Mmm. Oh, it's good, huh? Wow. Nice and nutty. That's addictive. Yeah, it is. A little too much, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I'm getting full. I can't anymore. I'll try one of these though. So this is a jelly bean. So it's basically, it's dough that's in oil in this yeah. like spiral shape and then they soak it in sugar syrup. Mmm. Mmm. Very nice. What an awesome meal. Mm -hmm. What an awesome day. Awesome day. Good food, good friends. Mm -hmm. Finally we can meet. I know, right? Hang out after like, feels like eight years of... I think so. Correspondence. We've been in touch for eight years. First time we meet today. Yeah. yeah first time. Yeah. First time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Great. And now we pay for the bill. Oh, come on. No, please. We have a big meal. No, no, no. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you Appreciate thank it. Bye-bye. We had a great time. Thank you. It's gonna be good. So we're in the next emirate. So what's here? It's basically food, right? That's what this place is oh, going yeah, for. Oh we're going full on today. Let's go! You ready? Let's go, man. Let's do it. It's gonna be good. <laughs> Rosanna, what is this place? What's this restaurant name? So this is called Alfana. Alfana is one of the oldest and the most traditional Emirati places. And uh, you know, like, they don't serve a lot of Emirati cuisine in UAE. So this place is the spot. From my understanding what happens is because the Emiratis usually eat this at home, right? So it's not like in restaurants. They eat a lot of cuisine at their place, so that's very rare to find Emirati restaurants here. That's why there's so much Indian cuisine, right? <laughs> <laughs> but you love it. Oh, I love it. I can't wait. We're going to finish it in style today. Oh, wow. It's going to be like a long day. Long day with lots of food and we're going to stuff David. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready. I can't wait. Let's do this. Let's do it. Matabalali, Emirati tray, yeah. and one uh, lamb nash nafshe. Nafshe. Uh, We're man. gonna get something healthy as well. <laughs> These are not uh, Emirati, but then they've like added yeah. it to, yeah, to yeah. this place. Right. <laughs> this is the lamb nafshe. It's cooked in a very aromatic potato and uh, aromatic curry. And then they also have the uh, barota. It's a Parota, but they call it barota. <laughs> what do we have here, Rosanna? So this is the bala leaf. It's kind of a sweet vermicelli noodle with egg. Oh, nice. Yeah. So this is also like an egg and tomato dish that they it's took. Shakshuka. It's not a shakshuka. It's their version of the shakshuka. Okay. Yeah. Faul. 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 Oh, fava bean. Yeah. Uh, fava bean. Yeah, it's exactly. And chickpea. Chickpea. So it's a karak. Yes. Yeah. This is the karak. Karak is very, very traditional Emirati version of the spice tea. Oh, wow. <laughs> so Emirati chai, basically. Exactly. Right? Emirati spiced chai. <laughs> Rosena, what is that? This is a green machine. <laughs> this is not Emirati. <laughs> it's like a green smoothie. And uh, this is the shawabs. It's also with the saffron. It's their oh. version of the pancake. Okay, and here we are. We got the full-on Emirati breakfast. Yes. yes. Looks <laughs> awesome. <laughs> so we just start with this one? What do you think? We yeah, can, let's you do can it. start light off with this. Let's start with the lamb. Let's start okay. with the lamb. We're hungry. Yeah, yeah. hungry. Let's start the <laughs> Let's day. start. Let's start. Let's go. Ooh, crispy paratha. Ooh. <laughs> it reminds me of the one in, in Chennai. Yeah. Oh, it yeah, thick. Now it's fluffy, still flaking, lots of layers. Yeah, lots right? of layers and very heavy. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, it smells amazing. <laughs> oh. And then just go right in. Just yeah. go right in. Ooh. Take that soft lamb, see how it's. Oh, mm -hmm. it's still so hot. Oh, still so hot. Wow. Potatoes. There's nothing better than lamb gravies, lamb stews, lamb curries <laughs> with tomato. Lamb everything. Potato, everything with lamb. Lamb is the best. Should we try it out? Let's try it. Mmm. 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 It's like a rich lamb stew. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like exactly. super hearty. Yeah. 
Mm. It's very aromatic and very light. Mm -hmm. Although it's lamb, that's why they serve it for breakfast. Oh wow! Yeah, aromatic, tomatoey, very very breakfast kind of dish, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. it's like the tomato the aroma. Mm. Almost like you could eat that with noodles. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, you can. Exactly. <laughs> Comes in this like little tava, right? Mm. You can go for another bite of that too. Yeah, it's really I good. Mean, I'm too hungry. <laughs> yeah. Mmm. Is that nice, eh? Mmm. It's so delicious. Lamb is my favorite meat. Is it? Mm hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. especially. <laughs> yeah. Especially here, right? Mmm. Yeah, especially in the Middle East. It's the best. So. This is the star right here for sure. Mmm. Wow, that's good energy for all day. Mm hmm. Yeah, nice filling meal, right? Mm. If you just have this, that's it. And we have karati. Cheers. Cheers, Cheers guys. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mm. Oh, yeah. It's still piping hot, right? Yeah. So good. Mm -hmm. It goes down well with the lamb and the. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. Great pairing right there. Okay, so next up, maybe we should try this fancy, uh, like, amazing. <laughs> Saffron pancake, right? Yes, it's mm -hmm. their version of the pancake. It's with a lot of saffron. See the inside? Oh, it's like aerated. Yeah. Oh, wow. It's like, uh, yeah, totally it's fluffy, very, very aerated. Bubbly. You can smell the saffron, mm -hmm. maybe a little cinnamon, yes. cardamom. Cardamom. Right? Mm-hmm. 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 Cardamom. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm. You gotta dip it in the saffron. yogurt. Saffron. Oh, you dip it in the yogurt? Yeah, you can dip it in yogurt. Okay. You can, they have the pineapple jam. Mm. All right. The melon, melon and pineapple. It's so much cool. saffron. Yeah, so this is like a cream cheese and yogurt mix. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you can taste the melon. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. So this is a melon jam, huh? I yeah. thought it was honey for a second, but wow. No, it's melon. Mmm. Mm. So good. So good with that saffron. Mm hmm. The melon. It's like infused into it. Cardamom. Love it. That's a nice pancake. Mm hmm. You can actually mix it with the. Cheese and the melon. And okay. That's how they... Although not much of tomatoes. Really, oh, really no, good. Oh, a nice omelet, huh? Yep. With the chili in there. Mmm, the chili. Parsley. Oh. It's been looking forward for this chili. <laughs> <laughs> and you took it. No, I'm gonna give it to you. Oh, okay. try it together. Yeah. So you're making like a little taco, right? A little yes. pocket here. A little taco, yeah. Mm, nice. <laughs> With a chili. Cheers. I should get a chili in mine too. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Oh, yeah, there's a chili. There's a chili. There's tomato in it, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah, okay. Tomato and egg. Cheers, guys. Mmm. 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 Oh. Wow. Mmm. It's nice. Oh, it's a chili. Nice spice. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. That's nice. There's some spice in there. Mm hmm. Mm. And this is, what bread is this? Yeah. It is their version of the, like a naan, but it's their version of the roti. It's a flat bread. So Rosanna's gonna make us the ultimate bite. She's gonna mix basically everything yep. yes. in one. In one. Break it into two. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's how they eat it here. They always mix and match their breakfast. Okay. So mm. they put a little bit of everything. This is just an amazing breakfast. I love that because I love mixing things. Yeah. yeah. I'm all about it. You know, different textures, flavors. Yeah. So that's a fava bean, chickpeas. Yes. yes. It's amazing. Okay. Yeah. So with the egg, <laughs> the bread, and then that's like a pickled salad, right? Yeah. Mm. So this is just with mustard in there. Yeah, a lot mm. of mustard, a little bit of lime juice and onions. Wow, luxury. Look at all the ingredients in there. Yeah. Wow. So, David. What a bite. Luxury. <laughs> Thanks, Rosanna. Ooh. <laughs> and you gained a small bite. Yeah, because I already had. <laughs> I know. See, we have a long day of eating, so you have to pace ourselves, right? Uh, Those fava beans are giant. I know they're massive, right? Try it out. Let's try Let's it. Try it out, guys. Yeah. Mm. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Whoa. Nice burst, huh? Oh. Mmm. So healthy. Super healthy. I love the bean, huh? Mm. Yeah. Salad's really refreshing. And this is um. So this one right here is a sweet noodles. Sweet noodles yeah. with egg, right? You can put it up on that. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> wow. Look at that. They do make the noodles yeah, with egg. With the savory egg because this is sweet. Mmm. -hmm. <laughs> mm. Mustard flavor in here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's very subtle, aromatic flavors, but mm -hmm. packed with protein. Mm. See, it's all like protein, protein, mm. protein. Mm, I love this. Huge fava beans. My <laughs> brother in from northern Spain. They have like fa uh, fava soup. Oh, cool right. this. Yeah. Mm. Mm. That's good. Nice breakfast. Very nice. It's <laughs> amazing. It hits the spot. Mm. Mm. I think for sure the lamb was the best, but this yeah. is really nice. Mmm. Never had noodles this sweet. 
Yeah, First time. Mm -hmm. Jenny, now we're going deep street Let's style. Go. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Good. I think lots of Indian street food today, right, Regina? Yeah, yeah. Lots of Indian deep street style food. Thank you so much. Oh. Bye. Amazing in Marathi breakfast. So good. Nice mix of flavors, textures. Oh, it was fantastic. Personally, I love the lamb. And as you can see right here, as you enter El Fanar, you have like the camel and uh, Marathi, right? And then they also have a blue Land Rover, right? Yeah, beautiful car, incredible. And now we're gonna go for some more food. Let's go. To be honest, I ate a lot. Did you? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I ate a bit too. Yeah. We needed it though, we were hungry. Yeah. We, we were hungry. We fasted a lot, right? Yeah, we didn't eat much and now we're ready for a full day of eating. Yeah, so we just passed like the entire, I guess, business district, lots of brand new buildings. Yeah, and in here, well, it's like street. fortress over here, right? So like really old school area. Yeah, it's beautiful. Lots of stuff up here. I think the restaurant's just right up here. So we just parked and we're walking over to a biryani yeah, spot. Yeah, local joint, Rosanna's selection, it should be really good. Everything she chooses is always good. Yeah? Yeah. Here in Rola, so this is one of the places that you have to stop for the biryani. What type of biryani? So it's like a Kerala style biryani. Oh. Their beef biryani oh. is awesome. Kerala wow. style beef biryani. Yes. Malabar, love it. Oh, it's right here. Local little joint. Hey, how you yeah, doing? How are you? Hi. Hey, pleasure man, nice meeting a long you. time. Hi, how are you? A lot of stuff, but their biryani is really, really famous and they're already really busy doing like takeaways. So how many a day do you sell here? 700. This is a Malabar biryani, it's from Calicut, like yeah, around there. Yeah. I've been there, I've been there. Really? Yeah, yeah man. All the way to Kassar God. Kassar God, yeah. yeah I mean, it's, it's still the Malabar. So, okay. Alright guys, we're going into the kitchen to see the biryani. <laughs> it's all biryani? Over there, there is biryani oh. and it's all packed. So is it all the same biryani, same thing? No, uh, no, we have four meats, which is uh, mutton, beef, chicken and we have the village chicken known as a lagoon chicken village chicken yeah mm. that's more uh, stronger than the broiler chicken oh, okay so we may use the all fresh meats except the broiler chicken which comes in uh, and which, which one is the wedding biryani or they're all wedding biryani it's all prepared in the style of that wedding biryani oh, okay the most simple very simple biryani simple yeah no turbos no charges nothing it's simple masala that's why you keep it and we keep the best ingredients. Perfect. Amazing. So this is like traditional dumb biryani. What does that mean? Well, they make them in these vats. They seal them, right? You seal them. Yeah, yeah, we do seal them. And you cover them. it. Like yeah, it's color. Color. Yeah. And we keep it for like 15, 20 minutes. Dumb is like, you know, we have the masalas and the meat in it and the down of this uh, pot. Mm -hmm. And when you put the dumb, the whole flavor comes out. So that's why we keep the holes here. The hole brings the aroma out. Do normally like this. Oh, so the okay. good stuff is uh, on the bottom, right? Yeah, the, the color changes. It's always on the bottom, right? Yeah, changes the color of the whole biryani. It looks amazing. Yeah, for our specialty is we don't use any color or any uh, special taste enhancers or nothing like that. What do you recommend? The chicken or the... the you have to meat? eat all. Beef no, is our all, top. All. <laughs> eat it all. <laughs> we make the fresh chicken and without frying and make it dumb. This is oh, how it is. Looks tender. Looks good. What's the name of the rice? This is the same rice. No, we use the, the same. Is uh, this is the jiragashala or kaima. Kaima rice. Yeah. Is it spicy or is it more aromatic? More aromatic. You know that Indian people like spicy, right? Yeah. So we need to be a, not very spicy, but it should be spicy. Have, a some, have some kick to it. Yeah. A bit of... Uh, just a little bit just oh, like this. Oh, yeah. Look at that. How with the plate it looks is. good, it? looks it? so good. So this is the beef one, right? Yeah, the beef one. Yeah, I love how you just cover it. Oh, yeah. right? That's how it is. Kerala style, just like that. Might be seen a yellow color biryani. No color. Yeah, natural. natural. Kerala is such a beautiful place. Like, so green. Yeah. Fresh air. It's a lot. Delicious food. Less people. Yeah, friendly less people. Less people? Let, let, I mean, 30 million people compared to Delhi, 30 million, you know? Wow. It's all about the mixing skills. Yes. It has to be perfectly mixed because if you don't get the right amount of masala, if you don't get that perfect ratio, yeah. the whole plate of biryani, it, you might not enjoy it, right? Yeah. Exactly. And then you won't come back. They always put out the meat first and then they cover it with rice. So if you ever see a biryani that's done on a pan, that's more like a fried rice. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys, it is time to eat this incredible biryani. We're trying three different ones, mutton, beef, and chicken. What type of pickle? This is a dates, beetroot. This is also served in this uh, marriage type, in the Malabar style. You put it on the biryani? Yeah, we put it a little. It's a touch. A little bit, okay. Yeah. Malabar style. They're always put the right side like on it right yeah, so you make it very creamy it. and then it's like it's like a paste and then it's oh, <laughs> oh, yeah. all together maybe somebody will just uh, touch with the finger 
This is maybe somebody will mix with the rice. This is the papada. Maybe you don't know very well. And you can just crack it over the yeah. biryani. Look at all these biryanis. Oh, okay. Beautiful. Wow. And I love the way you packed it. It's like perfectly round, like mm -hmm. a like a like an orb. Yeah. Let's go in. And this is the prize. We don't even know which is which yeah. at this point. Let's go in. Oh, oh. masala in the middle. Oh, nice and hot. I think I got beef. I got yeah, the chicken. The biryani. Oh, I got the mutton. Yeah, that. The mutton. Mm. Oh. So oh, break wow. it up. Oh, nice bone here. Oh, wow, the rice. You can feel it. It's just soaked in. Mm -hmm. All of the nice juices and moist. from the meat. Yep. So beef, chicken, and mutton biryani. Let's try it out, guys. Let's try it out. Wedding biryani. Let's do Cheers. it. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh. Mmm. Oh they teleport me back to Kerala. Mm. Wow. Whoa. That meat is so tender. Mmm. -hmm. It just melts. You don't need your teeth. It's just. Wow. You don't need your teeth. It's that smooth. That's really nice. Very, Is it very spicy, like the. Uh, not spicy, just smooth, aromatic. 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 And now we just put some of this on the side, right? Mm -hmm. Want some? I put it right on there. Right on there. Yeah, right? thanks, buddy. There you go. One, two. Little, little, little. It's little. A little. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's, like it's like using a wasabi now. <laughs> oh, 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 give me a lot, give me a lot. Okay, wait. I like wasabi. Uh, we gotta try it, we gotta try it. Uh, try, try, try. Yeah, you gotta try it, you gotta try it. Uh, so, this is the extreme. <laughs> so, it sounds like this is the extreme pickle. Yeah. yeah. So, it looks like a plum jam. Yeah, but it's, right? it's made with beef. Beef root and dates. Oh, beef and dates, okay. Yeah, that it's sounds spicy unique. like other ones. Okay. It's, it's not spicy. Uh, we'll Let's see. Try it. Out. <laughs> try it. Mmm. 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 Oh. Mmm. Really nice. Mm. You can definitely tell it's sweet from the date. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah. A little sour, but not too sour. Yeah. It adds a freshness. Exactly. To the biryani. But it blends in well with the rice. Yeah. And it pops out all the flavors. Mm. Incredible. Wow. It's really popping, right? Mm -hmm. The flavors not, are popping. It's not too out. strong. Yeah. Not too strong. You can add a lot of that. Yeah. yeah. Mm. I wouldn't say wasabi. I'd say a little lighter than that. Yes. Never ending biryani. Wow. So good. Mm -hmm. That's really flavorful. Mm -hmm. And very, very homely. Can mm. you feel the taste? Homely. Very homely. Mm -hmm. Homely. Not, not exactly street style flavor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. So authentic though. Mm -hmm. A lot of Kerala here, right? In uh, UAE. Yeah. Kerala's. And mm. I love Kerala cuisine. Oh, me too. Crack a paparam here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crack a paparam. Crack a Yeah, so next time you crack a paparam, just grab one like this. Let's go right here. You gotta. Yeah. Salpe. Salpe. Like salpe. <laughs> wow. Uh, nice that uh, you can. All right, now my turn to eat the beef. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a little piece right there. Oh, it's really good. Oh yeah, right there. Mmm. Mmm. This is the best. Beef is, is that the best? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got lucky. No, yes. No. Beef is the best here. Oh, I got lucky. No, it's all yum, but that's the. That's the best. The best yeah, I mean, in Kerala, it's all about the beef, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So good. I got the mud and bone, and you got the marrow right here. You suck. <laughs> oh, you got a bone! Oh, it came out there! Oh my gosh. Wow, that's a rare, like. Yeah, yeah. Patty meat. It's a delicacy right yeah, here. Yeah, the... patty meat. Can yeah. I find another bone anywhere? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, no other bone. Ah, a lot of bone marrow in there. <laughs> wow, nice bite. There, David. Yeah, right. <laughs> okay, I mean, we have there. a two-hour break, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. We have a two-hour break. Oh, yeah, there it is. Look at that pickle. Look at that pickle. That's what it's all about, right there. It just pops. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. The marriage biryani. So we got the chicken. Still really hot. It weighs a lot. It's really hot, heavy. Ooh. There's the beef, the mutton, and then you got the village chicken as well. Yeah, the lagoon chicken. Wow. Ooh. Let's try it out. Let's, Let's try, try it out. Try it. Oh, oh, it's heavy. Oh, it's heavy. Wow. Uh, you know what? I'm taking it home. <laughs> With pineapple, mint, and lime. Lemon. No, in India they have like this masala water basically. It's yeah. similar, right? It's not masala. It's purely the juices. Oh, so no masala. No, no masala. Mm, no nice juices. Yeah. Pineapple here too? Yeah, the pineapple and the mint and lime. So you got a pineapple chunks as, as well with the basil seeds. Mm. Very nice, refreshing. Mm, love it. Nice way to clean my palate. All right, thank you so much, my friend. Hope you enjoyed it. Amazing Malabar biryani. The pickle. The pickle? Pickle made it. Homemade. <laughs> we owe you. No. That was a pleasure, you know. I really want you guys to have and try. That's it. How much do we owe you? No? Just uh, uh, love and uh, <laughs> likes. That's it. <laughs> and now you're nice and busy. 
Yeah, it's going to be a little more packed, maybe. Yeah. Right, guys, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Enjoy, everybody. Shukriya, shukriya. Let's go. My man, thank you so much. Hope thank you enjoyed you. it. Appreciate nice meeting it. you. Pleasure. Awesome. It's really nice from all the way from Miami. Now you guys know the best a dumb biryani, Malabar style dumb biryani in the UAE is right here in Sharjah and he's opening up. Mafil biryani. Yes, yes. Thank you. Thank Wedding you. style. Ready? Let's go! Let's More go. food all day. I need a break. <laughs> Where are we going next? We're going juice world. Juice Having a, world. a juice break. Let's go inside. So I'm going oh, with the pomegranate juice. Eat. What are you gonna get? Oh, faluda. A faluda. I'll just take a faluda. And a water. <laughs> <laughs> I can't, because the faluda gets me too full, you know? <laughs> it's so cute! I got the cutest faluda, look at that. <laughs> look at that. Mmm. Mmm. Got some pomegranate juice. Mmm. Oh, I need that refreshing, huh? Yeah. So hot outside? It's perfect. What'd you get? I got like a lemon drop. Just lemon juice, ice, just a lemon shake. I got a lychee shake. Very manly, huh? Very manly. Which is going goes down. Mm. What'd they bring you? They brought extra, like, nice items. It looks beautiful. Oh, oh my god. This is a, so it's <laughs> three falutas? Okay. Oh, looking okay, good. Okay. Okay, I'll do it. Nice. That's how it is. Wow, it's awesome. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Looking good. When you go around with the food ranger, everything's comped. <laughs> this just nutty mix of ice cream, fruits. Oh, I'll try this one. Mmm. How's that? Mmm, delicious. It's good? Mm hmm. Crunchy. And sweet, obviously. Ice cream. That's nice good. and fruity, yeah. That's oh, fantastic. I love it. This is how it is. Usually in India, they'll just mix everything, right? Mm-hmm. Mm mmm. Worth it. Mmm, the crunchiness. Mm-hmm. Let's try the bite. Mmm, mango. Mango? Mmm. <laughs> you enjoying that one, huh? Mmm. Super good. Yeah, the second one is a mix of mango, you got nuts, really refreshing. What else is in here, Ting? It's like rice puffs, right? Rice puffs, right? Mm. Yeah, exactly. Oh, they got rice puffs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. That's the one. Yeah. That literally feels like I'm in India. You know, all the juices, the faluda, all the crunchiness. It's awesome. And here, as you can see, all the fruit hanging, all fake fruit, obviously. Or actually, it's not fake. This is real fruit. They just put it up here like that, <laughs> with tape. Amazing. And yeah, great spot to come, you know, especially when it's hot outside. It's right now, it's 2 p.m., super hot. I'm just having some pomegranate juice to freshen up. Oh, I'm super tired. Still jet lag after three days. So we're gonna eat some Yemen food. Yes. Mandi. Mandi. So it's like a rice dish. Yep. Right? It's a rice dish. It's cooked in the stock. Okay. But here the speciality is you get the salmon mandi. Salmon mandi. Amazing. Yeah. yeah. I'm excited. I haven't had salmon in a while, so it's gonna it's be gonna good. It's gonna be good. <laughs> and it's the restaurant Beit Al Mandi. So Yemenite food. How are you doing? Good? Yeah, yeah. Nice mandi. Good mandi? Yeah, good mandi. Oh. They've got all kinds of meats and kebabs and they've got the fish. So these are all the platters, right? Yeah. Oh, so we got the barbecue mutton. Different mutton platters? Yes, it's very hard to get it here in UAE. So Sharjah is one of the spots that people come to all around from UAE to eat the salmon mandi. Oh, it's basically a delicacy here in Sharjah. Yes, it's a delicacy here in Sharjah. Wow, amazing. <laughs> they do a lot of mutton, chicken, fish. One camel kapsa. Mm -hmm. yes. Oh, and what's this? What is this? So this is the lamb stock. They boil the lamb in this and then they take the lamb out to be cooked or grilled. But they offer the soup to pour it on top of the rice. Oh, wow. I'm half asleep, so I need some Arabic coffee. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's good. Aroma. Mmm, that's golden. You know, when you travel from America to the UAE, it's a 14-hour flight, so you need literally, well, you need an hour or a day per hour change. Yeah. I so I need this. <laughs> Nice, right? Strong. Mmm. Mm. Yes, this is what I love. It's gonna wake you up. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Super strong. It's so different, right? The Arabic coffee? Yes, it's very aromatic mm -hmm. and subtle, but gives you a good punch. Yeah, yeah. Just one shot, right? One shot. Ah. Oh, I'm awake now. <laughs> it's kunafe. It's a dessert. We made with fried vermicelli and they put cream or cheese in the middle and they put sugar syrup on top. Mm. You can put pistachio, rose, rose essence, 
it's really lovely. We got access to go in the kitchen. We're gonna see how they plate this Mandy. Oh, look at this! Wow! Giant Mandy grill. Wow, so this is the special. The grilled chicken, the grilled fish, lamb, salmon. Wow, it's just giant. Yeah. Giant look portions. At the, look at the pot that they're making. It's huge! It's, it's like a giant pot! It's oh a giant God. platter of rice. Yeah. Beautiful. What do they have? Raisins? What else do they have in yeah, here? Yeah, what do we got in here? We've got spices in there like cinnamon, cassia, onions, garlic, and raisins. Oh, and saffron. You can see the saffron. Yeah, 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 yeah. Saffron, yeah. yeah. saffron. Yeah. Is this a banana leaf? Yeah, banana leaf. And, uh, and then some mutton. And uh, potato. Little spicy oh, this one. Oh, spicy. Stop. And then this is mutton matroon, right? This this mutton matroon. Mutton matroon. Yes, mutton matroon. Mutton matroon. Yes. So, what's the difference? Spicy. Oh, spicy. Spicy okay. and then just uh, turmeric. Right? The special order. That's why they have everything. So they have the mud spoon, the the, no, the normal mandi, and then the raisins and the, the cashew nuts, almonds. It's like a special platter. This is kapsa rice. This is magud rice. Uncle Emirati yeah. Arabic all spices. All of Emirati, all of uh, Arabian. Amazing. Thank yes, you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank, thank you. You're welcome. Look at the chicken. Wow. It's all takeaway. It's popping with color. Right here they have the chicken mandi, and the reason it's so rare is because they added saffron. And inside here, there's like a million chicken. Chicken on rice. That's basically it, right? Yeah. It's crazy in here. So amazing. I know. Honey's jam. Honey's yeah, jam. So they put a lot of turmeric in their saffron and then their own little marination. They have their own spices and they grill it. Oh. Special platter. Wow, so four types of Arabic rice here. Oh, wow, four types. Look at this. That's the whole lamb? Huh? Don't touch this one. Oh, I won't. Don't want to lose my skin today. <laughs> a crunch. Wow. That's super good. To be honest, this is what I want to eat. <laughs> This lamb, whoa! Oh my Amazing. god, oh my god. Look at how tender it looks. She's so jiggly. Jiggly and Look at the jiggle, look at the jiggle. See that jiggle. Oh. The ribs, man, that's the best part. It's super hot. Oh, look at the jiggle. It's scorching. Oh, look at the head. Yeah, oh, the head, the head. Oh yeah, thank you so much. So You're welcome. welcome. It's raining. Yes. It's raining with goodness. <laughs> the bum is the best part here. <laughs> it's so packed. People love the food here. Oh, it's the food yeah. I mean, this platter is just insane. Oh, and then chili. Chilies yes. too? So we're going to get a platter, but maybe not quite that we big. We can't finish that. <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, we're not getting a platter this big. This is just huge. This is for a family right yeah, here. Right? A big family party. Exactly. Nice Shukriya. to meet you. Shukriya. Nice you to meet you. Thank you. Okay. Let's go eat, man. Let's go, let's go. Let's go eat. Cannot wait to eat right now. Looking good. So what do we got? Oh, here's the special salmon. Yes. The Arabic spice. Is this right here? This is the camel meat. Matan. Camel meat. Camel mani. Oh, I love it. Last time I had that was in Pakistan. All right, we are ready. Oh, so here we are. So we got the full on salmon with the Bukhara rice. Yeah, Bukhari mm -hmm. rice. And then the camel. Mandi. With the mandi rice. Yes. Amazing. A bunch of chilies and the salsa. What was the salsa called? Shata. 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 Look at that. Shata. So how do we do it? So we can, we have to first put the onions on top. Onions on top? Oh, onions on top. Sprinkle wow. it all over. And this is blackened salmon with the Arabic spices, right? Yes, it's the Arabic spices. So the rice has like cinnamon, cardamom, uh, white pepper, Arabic spices. And this is more milder version. Milder so version. Milder version. That's onions, tomato, the all the lamb stock. Stock is actually in the rice. Yes. Yes, that's wow. Oh, you're gonna dump the, dump the chilies? Yeah, so we're gonna like. Un oh, oh dump like the chili. <laughs> so, with every bite, you can like have a chili? Let me get one. Okay. <laughs> oh, <laughs> mm, not so bad. Not so bad? It, it's so gonna bad. come. It's, it's gonna, gonna come. You think so? <laughs> I okay. hope not. And then this is the lamb stock, right? Yeah, so you oh, can wow. add the lamb stock Ooh, into the into the rice. Into the rice. Yeah. You can add a little of the shatta. The so salsa. Can, wow. So each bite gets. Oh wow. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Oh, wow. This is so colorful now. Yep. It's a mix, right? Yeah. Should Sam we go for the salmon? Yeah, or I think so. Salmon? salmon first. Salmon okay. first, right? Look at that blackened salmon. Yes, it's all the Arabic Ooh. spices. Just gonna really? break it up. Oh, it's, oh. Look at that. Oh. Blackened oh. Arabic oh. spices. Oh, it's tender. Mm hmm. And oh. moist. I love this piece right here. Oh, oh look at the black. Just gonna mix it into that oh, rice, right? Let's get it with yeah. the yogurt and the Arabic salsa. Wow. Let's try it out, guys. Let's try it. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Good, right? Mm. Wow! Yeah. <laughs> so nice. That is so tender. Mm hmm. Super tender. 
Mm. Mm. Love the blackened part, right? And the the blackened aroma. aroma. Mm -hmm. The aroma. The aroma, the rice. The blackened the aroma. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm. It's super, like super yeah. moist, right? It's so good. Oh, Bridge just grilled to perfection. Mm. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Tendery with a little bit of citrus from mm -hmm. the lemon that thing squeezed on there. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, it's mm. so good. So easy to eat, right? Well, about salmon, mm. it's not too like salty or fishy. Yeah. That's seriously delicious. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. So That's some of the best salmon you'll ever eat right there. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. That's why it's a delicacy here. Yeah. Okay, man, I'm enjoying that the salmon. That salmon is so addictive. It's super addictive. So tender, so moist. Mm -hmm. Really good. Juicy. That's how you're supposed to do it, right? Yep. See that? Oh yeah, you got the skills, man. Do we break up a little bit of chili? Something in here? Maybe some of that? You got the real skills. Yeah. Mix it all in. Just gotta make it like that, right? Can I pour a little salsa yeah, on there? Yeah, you do can. Do it. You can pour as much as you like. That's the flavor right there. Look mm -hmm. at that. Oh. <laughs> oh, so satisfying. You're that salsa fresh salsa, salsa flavor. Mm. <laughs> it's good, isn't it? It's so good. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The yogurt. And then one bite of chili just to give that kick. If yeah. You... Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh, that's a. Not too bad. Not too bad. Fresh. Good. Mm -hmm. Fresh chili. Fresh chili. Fresh aroma. I'm sure it's like one in ten. It's like really spicy. Yeah. Right. Try the camel. Same thing applies. Okay. Oh. Put a little soup in there. Okay. Oh. We're gonna try the camel. Let's try the camel? With yeah, yeah. mandi rice. With mandi rice, okay. Oh, this is a little bit lighter rice, right? Mm hmm. With the camel meat. The how it just breaks up, huh? Yeah. Because the camel meat is very strong in flavor. Whoa. It's stronger in flavor. Yes. Look at the fat. Oh, yeah, yeah. jiggly. It's like a little more gamey, right? Oh, you got the fat? Yeah. That's the hump, maybe. <laughs> 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 that might be the hump there. Yeah. The hump. Only few places that serve the salmon, but this place is the best place. For me, so far in UAE. Wow. Entire wow. UAE. Amazing. Well, thank you for bringing us yes, here. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Amazing food. Yeah, incredible. And obviously, we have more bread. We have kebabs there. So, what did they bring us there? They brought like a special mixed grill platter. I love yeah. the camel. You love the camel? Mm hmm. It's very, very heavy, right? There's like no spices on it. Though. It's almost the same as salmon, how it breaks apart. Yeah. Right? Yeah, it's so well because usually it's a little bit more tougher. Okay. But they cook it really well here. The salmon is awesome. Yeah. They're Sounds both good. awesome though. The spices in there are just awesome. Mm. Good, eh? Mm hmm. You like the camel or the salmon? Salmon better. Salmon? Mm -hmm. But both really good, eh? Mm hmm. A world over, they have like a grilled piece of salmon with vegetables, and the salmon is always with salt and pepper mm. and not much going on. Got it. Yeah. Oh, so Super juicy, right? Mmm. How true? How true? Delicious. Shishi, eh? Love the camel. Love the camel meat. Salmon for me is. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. There's mm. a lot of Baitel Mandi places. That's why I got confused. You have to come to the Baitel Mandi Yemenite one. Ting and I are going ham here with the kebabs. Mm. But this one, this is like the fat of the lamb. So juicy. Mmm. Mm -hmm. this one here? Mm. This one nice? Yeah, yeah, that one's nice. Mm. Oh, everything is good. I know. Chili monster. Chili monster, you're eating all the chilies? Yeah. <laughs> so good. But you like spice, right? Mm. No, we pay, we pay, we pay. Pay, pay, pay. No, pay. No, no, no. No? Oh, it was a big meal. It was a big So where are we going next? We're going to be doing one of your favorites. Uh-oh. Yeah. It's a surprise. We'll see. <laughs> Okay, after about a five minute drive, we're here at Bombay Suites and we're gonna have some Bani Booty. Let's go! So this place has been open for more than 10 years and it's well known in this area for to be one of the best places. So besides Bani Booty, they also have Halwa, they have Jalebi, they probably have Ladu, you have Ladu, Rasgula, Gula Jamun, everything. Mysore packs, so a lot of like rice cakes slash, you know, super sugary. Made with ghee and milk powder. Put all the spices and it's really, really Looks nice. Good. <laughs> Hi, boss. We have the Bani Puri station. So, as you can see, they have all these different chats. Over here, they have Pada Pao, Pa Budgie. And right here, my friend, Bani Puri. Your record was 48. 48. 48, 48 Bani Puri. I had 48, well, Fuchka, which is 
Bengali style, but similar. All right, so he's making some for customers, right? So what he does is he cracks a hole in the puri. Yeah. He fills it up with chickpeas. Yeah, the chickpea, and then Aloe. loads the chickpea with some coriander and some mint chutney. Exactly. I think I saw a tamarind chutney in there too, right? For sure. Oh, so good. it's like sweet, yeah. and a little spicy, and a little sour. Exactly. All right, let's so go have some. Let's eat. Usually they put a dry potato filling, but here it's very, very saturated and a beautiful, thick, gravy-like filling. So it's very different and different feel and taste. Give me one already. Oh my God, Kanda. How was that? Mm. <laughs> it's a nice burst. burst. So after having a few pani puris, they usually give you a dry one, right? And that's what she's having here. <laughs> I cannot wait. It's like the Ooh. it's like the pani puri station. You can just like pop them down. So we should load up amaran chutney, right? Oh yeah, this is a little sweet. Little just dunk it straight in. Just yeah. dunk it in. Okay, okay. Like drown it. I'm gonna try. Yeah, dr just drown it. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Be careful. Yeah, be careful. You don't want it to burst. Yeah, it, it gets soggy if not. Oh, thank you so much. Perfect. And you had sweet. 48 one time. 48 one time after a meal. After a meal. <laughs> <laughs> so here we go. Mmm. Mm. Mmm. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh wow. That's everything, right? It's cooling. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little spicy, a little sweet. Nice crunch. I, I like that chickpea gravy. It's yeah. a little different. And it's different. Yeah, it's not like like alluing that. Yeah, exactly. Oh, it's addictive. Mm -hmm. oh. And the puri is so crunchy. Mm -hmm. Oh, I have like a million of these. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Oh, mm -hmm. the juice. Mmm. <laughs> so good. So good. So much flavor. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, so it's, it's with yogurt. Same, but with yogurt, right? Yeah. yeah it's oh, and they don't There's tomato, there's a coriander, it's more. Sev, right? Sev. Yeah. Sev right there. We have coriander. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, if I can even That's find the, it. That's the Dahi version. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. yeah, this is way more filling. Way more. Mmm. 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 It's like nice and chilled, right? Cold. Mm. The potato in there. Mm hmm. Nothing better. Mm -hmm. It's like chat style, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So you get a whole plate of that, right? Mm. Yeah. So sweet. And it's good here, right? Mm -hmm. What do you think? I think it's awesome. It's different, right? Yeah. I think that the filling is what makes it, right? The that mashed, is very different. mashed potato. Yeah. Mm -hmm. With all the sauces. Oh, mm. amazing. Really nice. <laughs> All right, my friends, I don't think we ate enough pani puri, so we're gonna have one more each. Yeah. You ready? Here it is, look at those beauties. Look at this. Wow. Nothing like a good pani puri. One of the best street snacks from India. Dude, it's the best. Seriously, the best. For me, it's the ultimate. Yeah, the ultimate. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. The pani. The little masala. So many flavors in there. Mm-hmm. Sweet, sour, spicy, crunchy, Everything. different textures. Mm. <laughs> Nothing like it. All right, let's go. What are we doing next? Luxury dosa? <laughs> let's go. <laughs> let's go. Thank you. See you guys. Shukriya. Zena, where are we going next? We're gonna go for a surprise dosa place. What? Surprise should be good. <laughs> yeah. I love dosas. Indian crepes. So good. After a 10 minute drive, we're here at TR Cafe. We're gonna have a dosa with beef. Special dosa, it looks amazing. Let's go check it out, guys. Let's go. Hi, hey, sir. how you doing? Everything good? Good evening, sir. This is a spot, right? Oh, um, it's a cozy little spot. Three tables, it's amazing. Just a hidden little gem here. All right, guys, yeah. so we're going to the kitchen to see how they make the beef oh, dosa. Hey, how you doing? So right now, he's making the masala for the dosa, the beef masala, so it's onion, tomato, oh, chili. I'm sure it's gonna be ground beef, and then over here, I think we're gonna witness a very unique masala making for the dosa. The wok is on. Look at this. Wow, that aroma. Oh, Coffee and then the like tomato it. goes in. Mm -hmm. Cabane. It's like a little stir fry. Oh man, the aroma's here. It literally takes me back to Kerala. You got a curry leaves, coconut oil. So many spices. masalas just coming together with that high heat right now. <laughs> Pressure cooked in that stock so that the beef will be nice and soft, and then they're gonna put it into that oh. masala. And chopping it up and mixing yeah. the masala with the wok. After he mixed the beef in there, he threw in like a curry and he made it a little thicker, right? Sear gravy. So it's like a beef, curry leaf. Yeah, so many aromas mixing in there. Yeah. All the curry leaves, the masalas, the cumin. Wow. wow. All going into a dosa. Yeah, into a dosa. Okay, we have a dosa batter, so that's made with lentil and rice. Yeah, fermented and look at that. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's so good. It's gonna go on this. Oh, oh. Only way to make it, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Real magic is this beef. Oh, what's this? 
Mogi. Mogi. I love it. It's super crispy this one. It's almost like a paper dosa. Oh, sambar. Yes. Coconut chutney. Coconut. Tomato chutney. After a few thousand dosas. <laughs> I'm excited. We're having a dosa at five at night, six yeah. at night. Let's do it. Hey, dosa anytime, right? Anytime, anytime of day. So right here, the beef dosa. No, the beef dosa. Yeah, that's a beef. Oh, beef in yeah. here, beef in here. Yeah. yeah, beef in here. I love all the chutneys. Yeah, the chutneys. Amazing. It's always with chutneys, right? Always with sambar. Yeah. Yeah. And then you, what you should do is you should grab a piece and then open this oh, yeah. and pour it out, Let's right? Let's take a look. Let's take a yeah, look. Yeah, so like just like that. Let's take if a look. I can get in there. Look at that. Oh, oh there's the awesome. beef masala. It's almost like a beef roast, right? Oh, yeah. it's scorching oh. hot. So you're supposed to get this, right? Go like yeah. that. Oh man, oh man, I'm getting hungry now. Let me get in there. Let me get in there. Go, come, come. <laughs> this is so hot. I gotta eat it fast because it's, oh, it's like boiling. Let's go. Mm. Mm. How is that? Mm. Mm. Oh, did you, same. did you eat with chutney? Yeah, with coconut. Oh, coconut. Always. Oh, never go wrong with coconut chutney. Oh, dude, always. So good. It's the best one. Oh, it's so hot. Yeah. Oh. That, yeah, oh, those yeah. are the one thing you have to eat right on the spot. Oh, right yeah. away. There it is. Look at that. Little dip in the coconut chutney. Yeah. I'm going for the tomato. Oh. I'll go for the tomato too. Yeah. That, the, the, the aroma coming from all the spices in there, mm -hmm. yeah. in particular the curry leaves, yes. exactly. is just so, so aromatic. My mouth is Let's try it out, guys. guys. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh. Mm. Wow. What did I tell you? Yeah. <laughs> that is it. Seriously, one of the best doses you'll ever eat. I think so. Yeah. yeah. And it, like, literally, like, if you've never been to Kerala, this would yeah. just teleport you there. Yeah. yeah. You don't have to go to Kerala. Just come here. The exactly. Kerala aroma. Straight up. Yeah, man. Oh. The curry leaves, the coconut oil. Mm. I know. Thank you, guys. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Mm -hmm. The masala's in that beef. Wow. It's like tropical. I know. Mm -hmm. It's tropical masala. Like if you're a meat lover exactly. and, and Indian vegetarian dosa lover, mm -hmm. this is like the perfect marriage. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> you're right. I really think this is one of the best dosas I've ever had. Oh wow. Straight up. I think just that that beef, you know, I guess with exactly. beef, rose, masala, with the curry leaves, the coconut. The All the natural ingredients. And the crunchy dosa. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Crunchy mm -hmm. crispy dosa. And this coconut, Johnny? Oh. Absolute best. Like unreal. I think we got fit. I think that's yeah. one of the best doses I've ever had too. Yeah, right? I'm curious. This is why I kept it for the finale. <laughs> <laughs> Started with karate and we're ending with karate. <laughs> yes. Cheers, guys. Cheers for a great Cheers. day. Great day. Thank nice. you so day, much. Guys. Awesome. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Sweet. So nice. hot and so good. Creamy. Yeah. Mm. For me, what makes this is the cardamom. Yeah. The cardamom's so good. Let's break that masala dough. Stuff. Oh yeah. <laughs> Look in there. Mm. Look at that masala. This is the traditional dosa. Mm -hmm. Masala dosa. Oh, that's the joy right there. Yeah. Put in the coconut chutney. Oh, it. oh it's like working. Oh. Yum. <laughs> wow. We started with chai, we're ending with chai. Yep. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Thanks so much. And that's it, guys. That is the full documentary of my experience in Dubai and Sharjah with Trevor James, the food ranger. Guys, please check out his channel. Follow him on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. You name it, he's everywhere. Thank you, guys. And thank you, David. It was an amazing day. No, man. Thank you. Thank you, dude. I have to go back. I'm like, I'm craving some Indian and some Arab food right now. Come on back, man. I'll go. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. See you soon, bro. Thanks. See you soon, man. Peace.